Okay, I can hear myself. Hi, welcome back. I'm gonna carry on playing through New Game Plus 2 all the way to Platinum. We're getting pretty close now. We're in Irithyll, so not too far left to go. I think last time it's been a it's been a little while. I think last time we we did the the old doggo at the front. So we'll just hop in and I guess make our way through Irithyll, which is a nice area. I like Irithyll. Yeah, new game plus two hype. Yeah, Irithyll's really lovely, uh, even though it's kind of awkward because it has those infinite stamina dudes. Mmm. Oh, I've got some lemon and ginger tea. That's good. It's a bit cooler now. It's been super hot uh, here the last few days. It's cooled down a little bit, which is nice. Nice to have bit of respite. I'm sure it'll be cold soon and then I'll be complaining about that so they come and go. Hmm. Do 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 do. Got to get back into the, the Dark Souls vibe. I've been playing Doom which is functionally pretty different. So let's just die to this first guy. That'll uh So much stamina. Okay, we've got decent stagger on him, that's good. That's good to know. <laughs> Ginger lemon tea, yeah. Oh, it's so good. Come on then. I know there's a bloke over on the right. He's gonna come down. Oh, come on. I dodged through that. This is what happens when you haven't played in a while. You kind of get... You forget the uh, the timings on stuff. Oh my goodness, I can't see. <laughs> oh man. Got to get my, my Dark Souls legs back. Oh boy. Yeah, it's been like a couple of weeks since I played this game. I've just been pretty busy. Right, okay. Get to it. Do 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 do. Come on, then, mates. Come on. I wish they had like a little inch less stamina. Yeah, it, it's, it's alright. I mean, it's nice to have stuff to keep you busy, but yeah, it's kind of awkward as well. It's always nice to have a little bit of free time. Uh, you know, and some of it was like, I was busy last weekend because it was my housemate's birthday, so like, that's fine. I'm okay with that. That's like a good thing to be busy for. Uh, but yeah, the rest of it's just been mostly work stuff. Which is fine, you know, I enjoy I enjoy working, um, which is nice, a lot of people don't have that luxury, but I quite like my job, so it's just kept me fairly, uh, fairly to the grindstone. But now we're here, playing Dark Souls 3, having a good time. How are you all doing in the chat? How's your week been? It's Saturday, that's good, I guess, unless you work weekends, I suppose. Man. Budding green blossom, some souls. Fire bro over here. The spicy boys. Come get spicy with me, sir. I don't want to get too close because I don't want to aggravate the guy behind him. I might have to though. Okay, if he's just going to sit and do... Doing pretty good. Good, that's good to hear. Man, he's not going to move, is he? I guess, like, maybe I should get out of his line of sight, but he doesn't strictly operate on line of sight, so that may not actually solve our issue. Oh, 
I really want him to come at me, but I don't know that he's going to do that. It's not really their style. They're casters more than anything. Uh-oh. Oh, that might throw me off the edge, actually. I don't know. Okay, it didn't. I was worried for a second there. See, the problem is we've got a lot of knockback uh, on our weapon here. Which means that it's pushing him back and then he's able to grab us. Whereas if you stay close to him, that grab move doesn't actually hit you. And it's less threatening. That's nice. It's good to hear you're doing well. Whoa. Now there's a second spicy boy up here, if I remember correctly. Um... Oh, maybe not. Maybe it's just he is the second boy. Maybe there's not another one. Not enough stamina for that. Crikey. Last Titanite Shard from that guy's backside. Um, is there anything up there? I don't think I've ever actually been up there. That's interesting. Let's bait one of these chaps in. Only one of them seems to be aggressive at the moment, which is good. Hopefully he'll run in on us and not try and just chunder at us all the time. Come on. Come fight me. Wow, they didn't break his guard. The other guy doesn't even care. He's just wandered off. He's having a nice time. Ah. Oh. He is the Spice Lord. Yeah, can you... Oh, no, you can't. Okay, you this... I saw the gap. Uh, I think it was this I was looking at, but when you're standing over there, it looks like it's on your level. Uh, but it's not actually. Right. Let's see if this guy leads me over to where he's supposed to, because he never has. No. No, he's still not doing that. I did see someone do this. I don't remember who it was. I was watching someone play through. Oh, I think it was Steve Gaynor. Uh, maker of Gone Home or Fulbright Man this this leads you that dude is supposed to lead you to this so that you hit it because it's the stupidest hidden wall of all time that you would never otherwise think to check for like no one has that much stamina come on he's just hacking There we go. Alright, we did it. We can go down and see Doris. Is this Doris? Or is like the... Uh, that's the eternal question, I guess. Is this Doris or is Doris... Somewhere? I guess it probably is, right? Because... Um, the other evangelists use Gnaw. And this, this one here has a specific type of Gnaw. So that would make sense. Go on, cleanse my curse. Let's... There we go. That's the one I wanted. The long delay gives us a moment to get in. Here we are! Yeah, see, you, you don't get it from the body, but I, I guess that probably is meant to be Doris. Gets a special gnawing. Um, let's have a look at it. Down here somewhere, isn't it? Uh, here we go. Those who linger too long on the brink of the deep will often slip. Doris is sure to have wallowed in this darkness, intoxicated by its peril. Ah, poor old Doris. Had a rough life. Well, it's over now. She's at peace. I think it probably is Doris. I presume it's meant to be pronounced Doris. That's not how I'd normally spell it. It's not like Dorhish or something weird. Dum 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 da dum dum da dum dum dum. It's very easy when you've been through here a few times to not really pay attention to how pretty it is. But it's very pretty. I'm very much a fan of it. 
Right, well, let's bonk out of here before these chaps come down and cause us trouble. Okay, so now I've got to make a decision about whether I'm going to save Henri or do the hollow thing. And I think I'm going to do the hollow thing. Probably. Um, just because, you know, I'm feeling it. And I like that ending more. Oh, I thought it might be you. Good to see you. And you too. I never managed to find Horace. But my duty must be done, even alone, as an unkindled Lord Seeker. For the children I knew, bless their souls. We all have our reasons, don't we? Please, oh, I. Take this. Recompense for my foolish request. <laughs> and also a token of protection. May the flames guide your way. Ring of the Evil Eye. Thanks very ah, much. You are brave indeed to face your duty alone. I would do well to learn from you. Mm hmm. May the flames guide your way. You probably would. Ah, don't you. I've made... Oh, I guess you don't give it to. You don't give me the gesture because I've already got the gesture. Henri's a guy? Yeah, Henri's a guy. Um. If you didn't know this, uh, Henri is a guy. If you were a lady, oh my god, I look fucking awful. Uh, ignore that. Hang on, you didn't see that. Da 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 da. If you're a pretty lady, a lovely pretty lady with some lovely smooth skin, then Henri's a dude. Which is important because you do the wedding thing. I was thinking about the wedding thing just before I came here because we're probably gonna, probably gonna do it today. Um, where's the uh, just plus one? Yeah, we're probably gonna do that today. And um, yeah, yeah. I, and I was thinking about the wedding because with. Um, them wanting you to be the Lord of Hollows. Uh, like obviously, the way they do it is they have two of you. They have you and Henri who are both pursuing the same path, and then you're the strong one because you end up with five dark sigils, and Henri only has three. So then they have you like absorb Henri's dark sigils instead, which is um, which is a nice a nice little touch. Now where are these dudes at? I know they're around somewhere. There's one. So I guess it's like they don't really care about having a male or female lord. What they care about is um, having the one who's stronger. Because, you know, it doesn't matter if you're a man or a woman. Uh, Henri will be the other one. Oh yeah, I forgot about you. I didn't forget about him. I was thinking about him just before I came in. Or just before I came down here. I was like, oh, I get to fight Creighton. Um, and then completely forgot as I got to here. Go on, let's get my stamina back. Oh, don't wake up. I don't want to fight you as well. you got to be real careful with that. It goes way further than you think. Yeah, Hollow Infusion. It's real nice, the Hollow Infusion. I'm a big fan of it. Oh, don't do that. I wonder if you'll just fall off the edge if I... Uh... Jesus. Oh, come on. Oh, he stopped me healing. Rude. I don't need to heal if I'm... If you're constantly... Uh oh. Okay, now not being able to heal is maybe more of an issue. But not if you're dead. Uh, I'm alright for Stones of Purging, to be honest. Uh, I'm not too worried about being hollow. But thanks for the offer. Uh, I think I probably have one. Um, but, you know, you get hollow again anyway. And also I've got the hollow infusion. Which I guess is why you mentioned it, now I think about it. 
Yeah, the hollow infusion is really, really good because it gives you the extra plus five luck stat. And it's probably the most damaging. Um, especially if you've got kind of all the stats, which I have, because I've just got kind of a, you know, this is my completionist playthrough. So, like, I've got stats out the wazoo. Uh, so, you know, it kind of doesn't, it benefits me to have uh, the hollow infusion because that gets the most different number of buffs from stats on the scaling, I think. Do 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 Hmm. Now I really never noticed it, but these doggos over here are weird and different. Like I actually didn't ever realize uh, like in like the three times I've played through this game. The only reason I notice now is because I, I listened to the bonfire side chat where they talked about this area. But they have like weird human heads. And I literally never noticed that. And I've played through this three times. And haven't ever realised. Like I noticed that they were slightly different looking dogs. But I didn't notice the... Bit of everything. But use none of it. Yeah. Always the way. That's the thing. Is like I, I'm now levelling up. Uh, I used miracles last time. I'm trying to use the sorceries this time. But I'm actually basically not using them. Because I don't really have... There aren't really many sorceries I want to use as a sort of basically weapons focused class. Like if I went full caster, then I'd perhaps be able to get more into sorceries. But I'm not doing that. And like not doing it means that the sorceries I have feel kind of impotent. So it's almost not worth my time. Hey, he's dude over here in the corner. Two hits is quite nice. I can't believe these guys keep hitting me. They got a long reach. Whoop. Go grab these bug pellets. Man alive. Wow. You know what? I should probably. Uh, well, I don't know. Maybe they're too low to do this. Um, let's try this out. Eh, it's, it's okay, but it, I think it does less damage, so probably not actually beneficial. This is nice though. Nice little area. Whoa. Hey yeah. Probably should have rested the bonfire. I don't think it's going to matter too much because we don't have um we don't have to deal with the doggo, because he's already dead. Just watch out for that guy drops down from above. There he is. So I don't think we're going to run out of health too easily. Before we get to the next bonfire. You see the glowy eyes, go towards it and run past them. Yeah, I, I, I always feel compelled to fight them, even though... Even though there's really no reason to. Like on New Game Plus 2, like, I don't really need to fight all this stuff. I don't know, I quite like, I quite like just bashing them out anyway. Feel that compulsion to fight. I'm like Seamus. Whoop. Can we go across here? I think you can. You can sneak across that corner. Do, 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 do. Straight through the table. We get Yorshka's spear. Lovely stuff. Lorshka's spear, more like. Huh? Huh? There was another dude down here, right? I heard her. Are you there? Hello. Good old positional audio. Always working out for us. Whoa, hello. Didn't see you there. Uh, is there something up here? I think maybe... I don't know. I'm going to go over that way just in case. There might be on New Game Plus 2. Do, 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 do. <laughs> you probably... Um, 
did you put like a, a dot after one of the like a full stop after one of the words because that sometimes it thinks it's a link and then I like that they don't delete the whole message at least uh, you probably like put a dot in and then not a space or something and it thought it was a link it's real weird real finicky now I know there's an item there which I should grab but it's just a plus one ring so I don't really need it but you know covetous gold serpent take out the caster first also because the caster alerts everyone else Arrgh. yeah it's the it's, it's a phone thing it's one of those things where you put the full stop in and then it doesn't leave a space it happens to me a lot as well you it wouldn't be a problem except Twitch then decides that it's a link even when it's not. Do 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 do. Little corner friend over here. Oh, there's two of them. Fancy that. I guess if they uh, get alerted by the caster, that maybe is more dangerous. Go around this way. Whoop. Oh, there's another person. Hello. I would have run straight into you, that would have been bad. Do 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 Capitalization uh on the phone's really awkward. Actually there's a the the problem I have with my current keyboard, uh since I changed my phone, is that um my old keyboard, if you used an autocorrect, like if you tapped one of the words to complete the the word you were typing, then it would put a space in when you started typing again. And my current phone doesn't do that, at least the keyboard I'm using. And I looked for a setting for it and there doesn't appear to be one. So I'll hit a word to autocomplete it and then just start typing again and it just won't put a space in. And <laughs> It's a nightmare. Um, you know. There's worse problems to have in life, but it's a bit of a pain. Hey! Take out these weird gangly fools. So I was contemplating this dude as well, because uh, you get the great heal from him. And uh, I hypothesized like, he could be the, the third archdeacon. Uh, the one who's mentioned but not in the game because you have the other two you have um, is it Royce I think is the one in the cathedral who you fight in the deacon fight and then there's McDonnell uh, who is I believe the dude who is the Aldrich faithful leader so you meet him down um, like in that little basement uh, it is an inconvenience you're right yeah there are worse problems certainly there's plenty of worse problems you could have in life yeah, but then there's the third there's the third archdeacon who I can't think of the name of right now, but he's he's mentioned but not seen. I think that might be him. Uh with the logic that I would follow as to why he's there being like uh it sounds like they all kind of abandoned Aldrich. Well, two of them one of them left with Aldrich to come here. The other two stayed at the cathedral. Now, it's implied that the th the other one, the third one uh joined the finger covenant the rosaria's fingers so if he did that that would explain why that dude's a grub um and then let's say he goes oh you know i don't want to be with the fingers anymore because i've turned into a horrendous grub i'll go back to aldrich maybe aldrich can help me comes back here forgets uh, or doesn't have the doll anymore because he's abandoned aldrich and maybe thrown the doll away can't get in gets stuck on that bridge because doesn't have the doll gets killed by the uh, the old doggo and uh, and body dumped over the edge that's my hypothesis on the third of the archdeacons yeah you know take from it what you will so I guess the beauty of Dark Souls is kind of they they even in this game which is very much a game about wrapping up a lot of loose ends from the series and particularly from the first game and it looks like the DLC might be continuing to do that. Um, 
they still leave stuff open, and I think even after the DLC, I'm sure they'll leave some some stuff open. Woo! Hmm. I can hear another dude behind me. Trying to gunk on me. Like that's a polite thing for a person to do. Nice little dung pie for us. These guys are real gross. Real freaky. Out of everything in this game. There's a lot of freaky stuff in Dark Souls. But maybe these guys are the most. I don't know. There's those weird hand monsters. They're pretty freaky. Later in the game. They're kind of hand babies. I say babies because of the way they move. Not really. They're massive. They're not really babies. But they roll around like children. Um, I'm trying to think. Oh, actually, I should just check that he's here. Actually, hmm. Do I need to... Maybe I'll do that now, actually. Do I need to do... To send out the thief before I come here? I'm actually not entirely 100% sure I've got the... Uh, the thief in this game. It's possible he's just not here. Right, okay, so... Your boy Sigurd is here. So it should work. Uh, I'm gonna go... I'm just gonna pop back to the shrine and see if he is actually there. It's possible he's actually not there and I've completely forgotten about him. Because I have a feeling I went to send him somewhere and he just wasn't there. Old grey rat. But we'll have a look and see. Are you around grey rat? Oh you are, okay. Oh you found Irthil in the Boreal Valley. He's not that Welsh. Oh, hello, you're back. And in one piece. What it is, daughter? <laughs> oh, we haven't given him the bone. Have thank you. Uh, Man. Goodbye. <laughs> I wonder if that means we're not gonna be able to send him anywhere now. Uh, I should find out. Let me try like reloading the area. See if that works. It's possible that we can send him out everywhere, but hmm. Hmm. I guess we could go and do the other boss fight first. That might work. If I went and did, because we need to do a boss to get him to come back. And if he wants to go to the early areas first. So now he's curled up. Okay, so that works. Okay. Right, we're making progress. This is a uh, this is questing 101 here. We're doing the complete grey rat quest in one sesh. I'm using Home with Bones because it's the quickest way to reload the area. I think. It's a bit quicker than quitting and reloading. And I've got so many Home with Bones. I bought a ton of them because I wanted to trade in my um, uh, bonfire thing for a shot. Uh, ah, there you know what, what, here we go. I might as well. well. Thank you. Great until I. <laughs> See, this is the thing. I don't know where he's going to go. And I don't. Goodbye. Do. I don't know if it matters if Sigurd moves on. So we'll see. Um, oh, I guess... Hmm. No, because to do Sullivan I have to go past Sigurd. I might go down into... Uh, I might go down into the profane capital first, final strike, because I need to do a boss to get him to come back. I'm not entirely sure. Ah, I should look in. I should look it up and see how he works. Uh, I'll do this while we're loading in. Grey rat. It doesn't really matter if he dies, to be honest. I, I just like doing the quests. Um, we'll head down and get this bonfire, at least. Levels don't matter too much here, so we should be good. Oh. 
Man, I'm never going to roll through that, am I? Wyvern. Uh, yes. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a good point. I could do Ancient Wyvern as well. Yeah, that's clever. Okay. Yeah, we can probably make this happen then. We can probably make this happen. Oh, there's a spicy boy down here. I completely forgot about you. Beautiful. I feel like he normally comes up the stairs, but I'm quite grateful he didn't, to be honest. Oh, you ran out. I wonder where he'd gone. I was like, hey, there's definitely a dude here. Large titanite shard. Ah, oh, okay. We're in good shape. I forgot we have to go through the dungeon to do this. Also, we've got an invasion here. Which, this dude's pretty tough. So, we'll see how it goes. I don't remember where, you come, where it comes in. Does he come in here? Now you come in here. Oh god, this is maybe a... <laughs> I tried to get behind him. Oh, that was a mistake. I should have just, uh... Should have just waited. Well, I, w I got behind, but I got behind slightly too early. And missed the backstab. And then got destroyed. <laughs> uh It's fine. Do 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 do. Yeah, I don't think I don't see you coming in. Wow, did he use? God damn it! Sorry, I just looked at my phone and had a. I tried to go to the Dark Souls wiki. And it's just brought up an ad on my phone, and my phone's getting, going crazy. Because it doesn't want an ad on it. Which, you know, I appreciate. Oh man, I'm gonna die. That was, uh, that was pretty close. I would have been annoyed if the Dark Souls wiki was responsible for uh, a death. Right, hang on, let me just take a look at this. Go its quest line. Da, 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 da. Sigurd can do it. Ah, uh, okay, hang on. Let's have a look. Maybe I didn't buy it from Grey Rat. Uh, I should probably just check that. Because if that's the case, we can just carry on as is. Um, I should go get my souls either way. So... Yeah, it says don't go into... If you go into Irithal Dungeon past the first bonfire, then uh, it will mess up the Grey Rat thing. So we got. I can't actually do my original plan of going through there. Fire Witch Helm. Oh, that's kind of nice. I don't. I'm not sure I've got one of those, but now I have. Um. Oh, I want to go down here. Bum 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 bum. So I I might go check Patches and see if Patches has got the set. Because if he has, then we can just use that, and that will solve our issue. Right, let's do what I did last time, and it will definitely work. I've had Alva, like, fall off the side multiple times. I don't want to say Alva's stupid. Just speaking from experience, you know.
Do do do. Got to reload the crossbow. That'll do it. Oh, I didn't do it. Okay, that'll do it. Right, so I'll grab this bonfire and then I will head... Oh, let me to bow. No bows for you, Alva. And then we'll head back and check patches. But basically, yeah, if we go into the profane capital uh, before... Uh, before fighting a boss, then Grey Rat dies. So, um, that actually, that might be if you've sent him out. Like, maybe if you haven't actually sent him out, it doesn't matter. Hmm. Hmm. But I'm going to check patches, because if patches can save him anyway, then it kind of doesn't matter. Dude. Do, do, do. <laughs> oh, even so, apparently that's not actually going to solve up. Maybe I'll just forget about Grey Rat. I don't really care about him, so I might just we might just skip this and go back to plan A of fighting um, Sullivan. I was gonna go through this, but it looks like if you go too deep into Irithyll Dungeon, it doesn't work, and if you go fight um, Patches, even here, the fuck did I do with What's Patches? With oh, sorry, mate. Have I spoken to you? Okay, that's fine. Uh, yeah, let's just abandon this. I don't, I don't really care about Grey Rat enough. Um, I've got all of Grey Rat's stuff, so let's go to um, the Distant Manor, and we'll just carry on, and we'll go do um, Pontiff Shalivan. Bam bam bam. Do 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 do. Back into the old sticky sewer. Oh, this place is a nightmare. What's uh, I was gonna actually I was gonna say what stops these dudes from coming out into the uh, into the main water bit, but they actually are totally out in the main water bit, so I guess I've answered my own question there, which is nothing. Oh my god! What the... I've never seen one of them do that before. Wow, okay. Okay. Deaths are plenty today. Bum ba bum bum bum. Light them up, and we'll head back in. Oh, 
They don't put bloodstains in enemies anymore. I feel like they should bring that back from Bloodborne. I realised that was only a Bloodborne thing. I thought it was quite a nice way to do it. But maybe they just, you know, they wanted to keep Bloodborne to Bloodborne, I guess. Which is fair enough. You don't want to mix things up too, too much. Hey, buddy. Uh, excuse me, I... I must have dozed off. It's rather warm in here. Well, well, hasn't it been all too long? It's good to see you. Oh, I seem to have missed my chance, so... I, Siegfried of Katerina, offer my deepest gratitude. And a little surprise to go with it. It's all yours. Thanks very much. What a lovely surprise. I know. Won't you join me for dinner? I make a fine Esther soup. I've got some stewing right now. Even we undead deserve a little normalcy from time to time. And finally, upon this rendezvous, let us make a toast. To your valor, my sword, and our sworn duties. Man, to, oh, to our valor, to my sword, and to our sworn duties. Long may the sun shine, boy. No. Oh, I say we do it with him. Somewhere, hidden right here oh, in Oh, here we go. Is a deep dungeon, and even below that, the profaned capital, home of Yorm, the reclusive giant lord. That reminds me. I've a grave promise to keep. Oh, sorry. I'm afraid I've cast a cloud over things. Well, I'm going to have myself a little nap. The only thing to do, really, after a nice toast. <laughs> I wish he had actual toast, but I guess Undead can't eat but he's got that lovely fire make a nice bit of toast or toast some marshmallows whichever way you want to go with it hey bucko I forgot how you're supposed to fight these guys it's been a while Rah! good old silver knight boys Let's go grab all the stuff from upstairs. You know what? Let's use old crystal magic weapon. I don't think it's going to make a drastic amount of difference, but why not? Come here. Beautiful. We get another one before our crystal magic weapon wears off. This is the thing, right, is I got used to using... I got used to using Carthus Flame Arc, and that lasts so much longer than uh, any of the other buffs, I think. It's bizarre. I'm not really quite sure why that's the case. But it seems to have a much longer duration than any of the others. See, look, it's already worn off. Leo Ring. Smo's Hammer. And a lovely little Divine Blessing. All for us. There we are. Divine Blessing. Right, now I have a feeling... There's a ring here. Yeah, I don't want to grab that. Because... I think that might be a good place to get like a screen grab for my Platinum Trophy. So I'm going to leave it here. And then we'll come back and I'll get some dudes to hang out here. And we can have like a little... 
a little shop. But that won't be for a while. Um, do 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 do. Uh, you're not going to come in, are you, Londor Shade? Because I'm allied to you. Which is for the best, because I don't want to deal with you. Okay, beautiful. I ain't no fool. I ain't no fool. There is another dog probably going to come down here. Oh, I forgot there were two dogs. Crikey. It's all go. It's all action. Okay, we made it. Have some of that. Right. Okay. That wasn't too bad. Let's pop in here. Let's activate the old lifterino. And we should be good to do um Your boy Aldrich. Not Aldrich rather, Pontiff Sullivan. Aldrich is later. What do you say? Betrayal! Not quite sure why, <laughs> but okay. I always find those weird messages like, I wonder if like a purple invader stabbed them there or something? Maybe this is kind of a good place to do it. Wait till they go in that corner, trap them in there. Do 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 do. I mean, if you'd like to, you're welcome to hop in. Hello, Jonesy. Nice to see you. Good afternoon. I suppose it's almost evening. Get in there. Do, 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 do. I should probably uh, like heal up or something before I die. How are you today, Jonesy? Whoa. Running me through. Just, just keep pushing the button. You know, if you keep pushing R1, eventually, eventually you'll kill everything. That's how it normally goes. Do 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 do. Soul of an old hand. Right, so let's see if we can fight one of these guys. What was that? I don't even I actually don't know what that was that he was doing. I feel it was like trying to do a buff or something maybe. Bum bum bum. <laughs> it's not currently a password. Uh Whoa. I mean, there is actually, I think I do have a password active, but. Right, if you tell me what to, what you want the password set as, I'll just do that. That might be the easiest way to do it.
Pam pam pam. Pam 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 pam. Wow. How many souls did I need? Because I feel like it's around the amount I have. I should check that. 28 or 280,000. Okay. Okay. There we go. You've never played a Dark Souls. At what level? Um, 193? It's New Game Plus 2, so... You know, if you can do New Game Plus 2... At whatever level you're at, then you should be fine. Ow. Cheers. Yeah, this uh, this katana is great because it. Uh, the beautiful thing about this katana is uh, that there's like a. It has a second smaller sword, and then you can like do sweet jumping attacks with it. Okay. Yeah, you should be fine. Uh, once you get past like new game plus one, it's all kind of much of a muchness, I think. So. Do, do, do. See, I would say if you have a specific password you'd like me to put on that you've already got activated, just let me know what it is and I will pop it on. And then I can get you in. Otherwise I'll just pick something. Do, 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 do. I'm just going to go and tidy all this stuff up first, though. But I won't be a second with that. And then we should be good. Alright, I will... Uh I will pick something... Uh, where it is? Under... System. I'm going to take off this one. I'll put on... Red. But... Three. Which is not a word. There we go. But I'm hoping because it's not a word it won't be something everyone uses. Red, but, three. All lowercase. I'll write it in the chat. Do 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 do. Right, I'm just gonna go do this. Henri's resting in peace already, I think, at this point, so we're committed to that. Which is fine. That's kind of what I wanted to do anyway. Right, I'll keep an eye out for you. I'll spy you among all the other things. <whistles> right, I actually probably should fight you because I'm going to have to fight the dude at the top. And if you follow me up, it's only going to be trouble. I think I see you on the left there. I presume that's you on the left, like by the uh, by the main door.
Praise the sun indeed. Let's get our Londo bro in as well. Hello. Where's the uh oh hello. Didn't see you there, sir. Ta. Beautiful. Let me have a look at my emotes. I've got somewhere in here, we've got the here we go. As you praise the sun. Right, let's do it. Do 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 do. Let's give this chat what for. Man, he's being aggressive on me. It's actually not particularly like him. He tends to switch his energy a lot. He's focusing on our poor phantom. Easy does it. Feel free to kill the other dude if you like to. I don't normally bother. But uh, you're welcome to. There we go. Cheers for that. That was good fun. Nice and easy. Not too much messing around. <laughs> just chuggle the... Just <laughs> I love that. Just celebrity chugs of the Estus. Neck it. That was good. Thanks very much. Right, time to get invaded, I guess. I normally end up not bothering to Ember for this area. Like, not because I don't want to fight anyone, but because you literally can't get anything but fighting done if you're uh, Embered up. Oh, that's the wrong way. God damn it. Hmm. Hmm. I really want these two to go next to each other so I can do that. That's perfect. That's perfect. Thanks very much. Huh. Give me your energy. Oh, what is this? I, I always remember there being something over here. It's a large titty shard. Great. Lovely large titty shard. Wow. Does that work? I think I missed it. Do some more carp if you like. Do 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 do. Da 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 da. Hmm. I kind of want to get these chaps to come over to us. I'm not sure how far you have to get to trigger them. There we go. They are on their way. Yeah, praise the PvP. That's basically what it's going to be. Bump, bump. Oh, you're coming in as a dark spirit. Okay, well, we can have a fight if you like. Whoa! Let me just uh, kill these dudes. 
Man, why is there an always an Eldritch Faithful one? When you want to have a fight. Be careful of those dudes up top because they will fireball us. Also, there's a giant here. There we go. Man, <laughs> I love I love how chaotic this area gets. Anyway, also there's these like general dudes here who are enough chaos by themselves. I didn't realise you were coming in as a dark spirit, otherwise I would have waited in that first area to do some PvP. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Ha <laughs> uh, Yeah, if you want, I'll, uh, I'll wait in that first area and we can have a, a scrap. And then I'll carry on after that. Let me just grab my souls before I do that. Do 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 do. <laughs> ba dum bum bum. Parried into death, nice. I haven't played, I've played a little bit of PvP in this, but not a ton. I haven't really gotten used to parrying. Like, I've parried a few people in PvP, but I haven't gotten used to the, uh, the timing on it. It's always a little bit different because you've got to kind of anticipate the, um, the lag, as it were, or like the connection difference. Right, okay. I head back over here if you want to have a if you want to have a PVP. Wow. Oh, do I actually not need to ember up for that? I thought I did, but apparently not. Anyway, I've embered up. It's fine. Yeah, just before the hit. Yeah, I I know the like the the theory of it. It's just it's trying to get the the exact timing down. Like I guess I could use the um, like a target shield or something if I really wanted to spend if I really wanted to focus on parrying. But uh, not too worried about that. I feel like PvP in this game, I really like the PvP, but then there's, yeah, when you're, the problem with, like, you can't invading and stuff is that you just end up, uh, you know, fighting like four dudes at once all the time. Whereas, if you're doing some, some versus PvP, Do 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 do. Alright, let's do it. I forgot I had my weapon out. Oh, is that the case this? I like that. Mm-hmm. 
Oh man. Oh, that should have hit me, I think. It's a good old lag there working in my favor. Oh, it didn't work in my favor that time. Oh, that's gonna do me. Oh, nice. Well done. That was good. That was a good fight. Oh, man. Right, okay. I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna carry on with this area for a bit. See if I can't get up to Aldrich. I've probably got to stop in a little over half an hour and go and get dinner. So we'll uh, we'll carry on through this area. I'll probably just go pop through it as is so that I can um, mm. Also, I really ought to level up, but uh, 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 maybe I should. There's the stupid Anor Londo bit. Uh, I'll run round. I'll tell you what, I'll run round. I'll open up the first little shortcut thing, and then we'll do it. Then we'll go level up before I do the Anor Londo archers, because those guys, real scrub lords. I think I grabbed the ring from over there. Kind of doesn't really matter because it's like I've already got two of them, so whatever. At a point. Do 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 do. Oh, hello. We'll go in here. There's a mimic in here, I think. I think. Maybe? Maybe there's not, I don't remember. I know you get the um the weird like spear thing. Is that lightning spear? I can't remember the specifics of it. Yeah, see look at all these. Whoa, there's a thing ahead. Yeah, eat that. Chest. I started playing Neverwinter recently, and that has mimics, which is nice, because I, I feel like there aren't that many games outside of the Soul series with mimics in. Like, mimics have been a concept in, like, fantasy and stuff like that for a long time, but, uh, not that many, not that many of them. Bring a favour plus one. Good old fat bring, always there for us. Especially in Dark Souls 3, where it doesn't break, then it is always there for you. One of my disappointments, I guess, with this game is the fact that the mimics are so identical to Dark Souls 1. Like, I wish they'd mix them up a bit more. Or, I, I, I like that they included the Dark Souls 2 mimics, you know, the um, the ones that get on all fours and run at you. Because they're harder to fight. But I, I do wish that they'd included, uh, like, an alternate style of mimic, or they'd changed the way that you could tell it was a mimic. You know, they just did like the same chain forward thing again. Which is fine, but, <laughs> you know, I feel like at this point, anyone who's played Dark Souls for a little while is just gonna, you know, it's a mimic, they're, they're gonna see that it's a mimic straight away. And it kinda takes the surprise out of it, of when you first play that game, and you first encounter the mimics, and you know, you don't expect them. Oh, I did actually want to travel. Travel to Violent Shrine. But yeah, there's something special about that first Mimic uh, discovery. And then Dark Souls 2, 
I think they actually did you know quite a good job with that because they they mixed it up again. Uh, they made the mimics with the uh, sort of stone chests they were harder to find. They made the versions or also they made like wooden chests breakable, which meant that you were kind of scared to hit them, which I thought was a nice little touch. Uh, I'm gonna guess no he in fact he's here. Oh, we did a boss, of course. Oh, no. oh, it... Goodbye. <laughs> oh, discover if the tales are what they if. Uh, sure. I'll send him. Goodbye. And we'll see. We'll see. If he comes back, he comes back. If he doesn't, then his body will be in Irithyll. And that's fine. Uh, you don't... Oh, I can give you these coals. Why not? You a fine prize. I'm honoured to be endued with it. Now I'll be equipped to infuse special gems. Praise the gods, eh? Time to put this brawn to use. <laughs> People talk about mimic bonfires as well, which I, I actually like the idea of, especially in this game where there's a couple of bonfires that are super close to other bonfires. Well, well. I think it'd be, you know, it wouldn't be too bad. It'd just be a good moment. Just have one in the game. You know, don't put it like in a, a really... Don't put it really far from the past bonfire. You should know. This coal is imbued with magic. And then put like a special item in it when you kill it. Hardly a surprise, is it? I've never been one for books. You know, maybe have that be the thing that gives you the... Like bonfire shard that lets you teleport. Pretty be careful. That would be cool. Hey, you know, whatever. It's not too much of a big deal. Back again. Come again. Come again. I don't really have anything to do with any of these dudes, to be honest. Uh, I will at some point probably buy all of uh, Orbeck's sorceries just so that I can finish off his quest and get the, like the sword again. Um. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh. I could put points into vitality. I don't know. I don't know. I think I'm gonna save vitality for next playthrough. Maybe. I just never feel like it's worth it. You know. You just, especially with the way armor works in this game and the way that poise isn't so big of a deal. I just don't. Th I don't feel like there's an incentive. To actually use heftier armor, so I think it's only really useful if you're going. If you're going for the big swords, obviously, then you need the uh, equip load to handle a big sword. But if you're just using mid-sized swords, then you can just wear slightly lighter armor, and it kind of doesn't matter. Hmm, actually I probably should speak to... I, I don't know if it matters, I probably should speak to... Uh, Uria. I might pop back and speak to Uria. Which I realise means some more loading, but it's fine. We'll, uh... We'll, we'll, we'll make it happen. Do, 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 do. You got anything to say? Even Why are you still saying that? Ah, for help. Okay. <laughs> He's doing all his dialogue at once. <laughs> Fair enough. Hey all. Speak thy desire honorable. Our Lord knoweth that he is hollow. Here we go. And will join thee in wedlock. Oh yeah. A fellow of mine guides him at this moment. When the time is ripe, thou mayst make thy salutations. For what look is badass pair of people? Perhaps. Till we meet again. May the I don't know if like um 
when you finish the game, if Yuri is meant to be like your right hand woman, or if she's meant to be like your partner in crime or what, because she kind of guides you to being the Lord. But then she just, she's not the Lord, you know, she doesn't like rule over you or something. So I wonder what her final purpose is, as it were, once she, once you achieve your goal of becoming the Lord of Hollows. Where does she go? What does she do? Does she just serve under you like everyone else? I'd imagine she'd like act as an advisor or something. Got her and the firekeeper as my like right and left hand women. I could see that. That'd be pretty cool. Uh, uh, yeah. I'll go up this way because I think it is slightly quicker. She goes. She goes to Londor. I think that makes sense. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, but I was. Um, it's more kind of you know. What does you know what what role does she take on? Does she just like hang out in Londor? Does she run a, a small bed and breakfast? You know, retire. Uh, you know, just take in the occasional hollow. Does she you know. She run a combat school. What becomes of Yuria when she goes back to the resurrected Londor, or whatever you want to call it? Maybe it will. Maybe it will, that'll be answered in the DLC. Because I would be surprised if the, if the whole Lord of Hollows Londor thing isn't addressed at some point in the DLC. I love those guys buff in unison, and they pull out their weapons in unison. What pair of scrub lords. I just don't want to fight him in front of the fireballs and the giants. That was enough to kill him. Nice. Right. One by one, these guys are pretty straightforward. Dies. Mate, you want to chill out? Oh, the bounce off the sword. Off the shield, rather. Look at that. Look at the way he deflects off it. Man, I keep thinking I can, like, get in a hit there, but my weapon's actually slower than I expect it to be. Does he drop... He drops the twin spears, doesn't he? Yeah. Do you get the twin maces from someone? I feel like you do, but I can't remember where. Uh, I'm going to go to kill the fireball dudes first and then to kill the giants. A little bit easier, a little bit straightforward. Let's make this easy for ourselves. Because that's what Dark Souls is about. Bum 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 bum. I quite like the kind of more relaxed approach. Like, I, I really enjoyed my first playthrough, you know. When I did my first playthrough, I always go through blind. Uh, I managed to find everything, I managed to kill all the bosses. You know, don't summon anything. Not even the NPCs on first playthrough, which does mean that you miss out on a little bit of the, uh... You get them in the cathedral. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah, it does mean you miss out on a little bit of story by not doing NPC summons. Um, but, you know, it's the way I like to do it on the first playthrough. Because I don't want any for bosses. Uh, I guess... I mean, you miss out on story. You don't miss out on NPC progression, I don't think, in this game. It's not like Dark Souls 2 where you have to summon people for fights. Uh, you know, you do the stuff with Anri, but the stuff with Anri is... If you save Anri, you go into her world. And the same with Sirius, you go into her world to do those. So you're not actually required to, like... Fight in co-op just to see all the story beats, if you want to. Which is nice, because I, I do like... Going through completely solo first time. You know. Bit of challenge. And you get to learn the fights a bit better that way.
Ow. Ow. Holy shit. I forgot how damaging these guys get on the higher levels. I know the other guy is a lot easier. Mm, maybe you can do it with this guy as well. The other guy is easier to kill because you can just uh, whack his head a couple of times and then just kill him straight away. I don't know about this one. That's upsetting. Now I've got to run back again. Do 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 do. Hmm. I guess we killed those dudes, that's kind of the important thing. I don't know how you tell apart the the thin ones. Like there's a stronger thin one and there's a a weaker thin one. And I don't know how, I don't know what the, uh, the tell is for them. Whoa. Oh, it's, I used all my stamina running at him. I was like, why am I, why am I not attacking? It's actually just because I used my entire stamina bar leaping at him. It was dramatic though, so you know, worthwhile. See, like, that guy's a three-hitter. Is it that they're slightly taller? This guy looks a little bit taller than the dudes next to him. Yeah, maybe it is that they're taller. Maybe that's the tell. Probably heal up before I die. I think it must be a height thing. Doop. There we go. See this guy, his head's up too high, I think, to get. I figured he was probably almost dead. Like, they don't have a lot of health. I was on the wrong side to get... You can get this guy's head as he's getting up, and it makes your life easy. But I guess it's not that difficult. It's one of those things where it's, like, it's not particularly challenging, but if you, uh, if you miss it, then... Uh, or if you actually... If you, like misstep you just die I was wondering what was making the noise but it's just my sword do 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 uh, if I see you I'll uh, I'll grab you but uh, I wouldn't worry too much but if I do spot you along the way this next area is more just kind of running up hills so I'm not even going to bother going down there for now. Because there's nothing down there for me. Like, I don't need to join the Covenant because I'm already in it. There's a ring of favour and protection, but I've got a better one. It's just two dogs. I don't want to fight two dogs. Hmm. Okay, point noted.
There we go. Dragon Slayer Great Arrow. Come on, mate. Come up here, because then the other guy definitely can't hit us. Probably should be careful. There we go. Bum ba bum bum ba bum ba dum bum bum. I don't really want to kill this guy just because he's in an awkward spot. But I'll grab the ashes. I feel like this is one a lot of people miss just because you kind of want to just get through this area when you're doing it. You don't really want to mess around. I do like it. Like uh, at that point, it's it's part of their real build. To hey, hey, doesn't this look familiar? Hey, isn't this bit kind of familiar? Isn't this whole thing pretty familiar? And I can get behind that. Yeah, she'll bash me, mate. What do you think this is? Five, five, five! Man! That attack, the thing with that attack that always gets me is when it moves your camera angle. I don't know why it does it, but sometimes when you strafe around them like that, you see it moves the camera angle and it makes you walk back towards them. And then you get horrendously murdered. I think it just depends on how you walk around them. But it's an, it's just annoying because it changes the motion like as you're strafing. You kind of get used to it, but Hey Bucko. Good name. Sue Warrior 420. It's a weird message to send though. I don't normally just group up with random players just because I have too many people who want to play with me as is most of the time. You know, it's not a mean thing, it's just. Purely a time consideration thing. This guy doesn't. This guy doesn't give a damn. Kind of don't want to fight you up here, mate. Whoa. Ow. Man, they always hold that a fraction longer than I think they're going to. What? You what? Uh, I've got to go through that again. What a nightmare. One sec. Alright, we're back. The eternal struggle. We did the difficult bit. And then I died to that dude. Bum 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 ba -dum. I really like this helmet. This Outrider Knight helmet. It's a nice, uh, nice bit of style. Oh, I tried to try to weave one bit too much. Whoop. Oh. Oh. 
I'm not going to sprint past all the silver knights, but I've got places to be. So. I might not go back over that way now because I kind of don't need to. Man, he just ate that like an absolute champion. Come on, sir. Oh, that came from below us. We should actually be careful of that. That is slightly dangerous. Go down there, can shoot at us. Or be we a, be a little bit cautious. Come on. Do your lightning attack or whatever you're going to do. I kind of got so used to fighting these guys with a big, like, two-handed claymore, which is just lazy because you just whack them a couple of times and they can't really do anything. Man, he dodged the backstab. Real rude. There you go. Didn't dodge that one. Let's heal up before he comes up. Every little bit helps, right? I like how he went to guard and just kind of looked over the shoulder as we, uh... He avoid the backstab again. Real rude. Man! Oh, I forgot about that. Easy does it. Let's take it nice and... Nice and slow. There we go. Oh, he dodged the backstab again. What, is, what have they been feeding these guys? Feels like they're more pro than they used to be. I've never had them dodge so many of, so many of my cheeky backstabs. Oh man. There we go. Wasn't too bad really. Right so, uh, I'm going to go open this just so I can go fiddle around and grab bits and pieces. I might actually not go down there because we left all those dudes down there. Might not be the wisest maneuver. But we'll crack the door. And then I'll head up, we'll do the wedding, and then they'll probably do us for today. Thanks for coming by though. Thanks for uh, doing a bit of co-op, a bit of PvP. It's good fun. I'll grab those items uh, next time we come down, I guess. Let's just uh, finish things off. Where's my... Uh, oh, it's like that. There you go.
Wait, where's our dude? Is it like, is, do I have to get to the next part before it triggers? Maybe it hasn't triggered yet because I haven't done something? Yeah, I guess not. Well, I'll come back then. Fine. Not getting married. Not today. That's disappointing. Put my fancy outfit on and everything. Ah well. Urgh. Ah. Memories, memories, memories. Good old Dark Souls the first. This is actually where I'm at in my uh, Dark Souls one playthrough on YouTube. Is uh, I, I don't know. If, mm, I don't know if the episode currently on YouTube is at that point, but uh, in the recording, I'm up to basically this lift, which is poignant, I suppose. Bum bum ba da bum 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 ba da da bum bum. I guess I should probably go round, like so. Okay, there we go. Now, if I refresh it, does that? I'm gonna go down and just check. Uh, either way, we'll we'll do the um, we'll do the other bit as well. We'll do uh, chatting to the dark moon lady. I wish you could activate this thing from the top, from the bottom, so that you didn't have to run all the way around. Right. Did that make a difference? Can I get married now? No. Well, this. No, I'm sad. All right. I think it's maybe because of the way I've been playing through, because it's like a subsequent playthrough. It kind of wonky things up a bit. Oh well, let's just go do uh, the invisible lady in her tower, Captain Yorshka. Well, I guess she's not invisible, she's the bridge to her. Blade of the Dark Moon. Welcome home. If I can provide thee sucker, only tell me how. You're a sucker. Nah, I'm kidding. You're all right. Long ago. I'm sorry I had to kill you last playthrough. I needed all the weapons. The the You've got one of the ones you can't get any other way. His own will. Now, the fire is linked by the champions. Which made me kind of sad. Such is the will of Father and the gods. And so the Dark Moon Knights took arms. It's like Yoshka's chime, I think, you have to kill her for. Fire. There's no other way to get it. But long ago, our company lost its last proper knight. Only its covenant was preserved to this day. Until the time of thy visit. Erdem taketh many forms in See, now Sirius is a knight of the Dark Moon. I wonder if... Off so soon, may... No, oh, I probably should finish talking to her until I flew up here or whatever. Oh... If I can provide thee succor, only tell me how. I wonder if Sirius is meant May to be I like in question? the past, but she is in our world normally. Is so art thou a... Oh my, then thou art a dragon? Or perhaps a crow? Well, whatever thou beest. Thou See, it's funny because it's like beast, but spelt wrongly. Familiar. But it's actually is beest. <laughs> Cheers, love. So soon, may the dark. The dark moon's here. Cheers, love. The dark moon's here. 
Uh, which way do we go down from here? This place is a nightmare as well. Nice easy place to die. Uh, yeah, easy does it. Painting Guardian's Curved Sword. And the Painting Guardian set. Fantastic. Um, Oh, that was, uh... Wait, did I miss something? Damn it! Damn it! I went back to the shrine. Good lord. Alright, <laughs> we'll wrap it up there. I'll, uh, I'll grab the item on my own time. And, uh, yeah, we'll come back next time. And next time we stream, I guess, we'll do... Um, Anor Londo. And then we'll go do the dungeon in the capital. So thanks for joining. It's been a lovely time. Hope you've enjoyed it. Might level up if I can. Um, be sure to follow me on Twitter, I guess, if you want to see when I'm streaming. Which is at KenY2Ken. Or you can follow me on uh, Twitch. That'll do it. That'll let you know when I'm streaming. You can also go over to the YouTubes, which is youtube.com slash KenY2KenTV. Which is actually where like more stuff goes up. I, I tend to stream here on occasion. I'm trying to stream a bit more, but uh, there's m probably more regular content on, on YouTube, so if you're after regular content from me, Welcome that's the place to go. Very well. Can I level up? Do I need more? I can. Fantastic. Okay. 42. The meaning of souls, the universe, and everything. Fantastic. Thanks very much for joining. I will catch you very soon. Cheers!